Scarlet. Did you find what you were looking for? Damn right we found it. After all, who knows where we're going? the city above ground. Red Herring. The one up there was a decoy intended to protect the real Delphi from its enemies. Please help me. I am trapped in the temple of Apollo. These ropes are... We're not the first ones in here. my idea and all, but I'm starting to have some second thoughts. Third, even. You just face death, sure. What could possibly scare you now, huh? <laughs> know thyself. I hope you know what you're doing, Scarlet. Where is my father? Where is Alastair Rhodes? Just like your father, I too am a prisoner. These bonds prevent me from freeing him. I not stop thinking about Scarlet. She's not like any woman I have ever met. She's utterly immune to my charms. Starting to see why Dad kept so many books on Greek mythology. And why he made me read them. Well, Dad, you were right about a lot of things I thought were just lies. I only hope those things don't kill the both of us. Right, Stanton. Now would be a good time to remember your ancient Greek. There won't be any handy Rosetta Stones lying around to help with transcriptions. Mm, sometimes I feel as though we are being guided by unseen forces. But to what ends? <gasps> I know you can hear me. You have ignored me far too long. Who says that? Show yourself! Gentlemen, and I use the term loosely, give me just one second to properly greet you. Think fast, Scarlet. The rotting bastards are everywhere. Goodness me, I'm piggy in the middle here, aren't I? Better get busy! Well, I am still alive, but also still alone. Au contraire, Monsieur Delacroix. I have been with you ever since Morocco. Once again, I face overwhelming odds to free a lovely woman from the chains of oppression. Or as I like to call it, 
Tuesday. A month ago, everything was normal. But now I'm seeing impossible creatures every other day. How does this keep happening? Wherever you are, Dad, you sure pick some fucked up places to visit. So, is this mythological humbug fabricated by the Sentinel artifact? Or were the Greek gods real? Mate, you are the last person to ask what's real and what isn't. This voice I keep hearing. Am I going mad? Will I end up like Shaw? Ah, uh, yes. Your brother Rena, Stanton Shaw. Funny you should bring him up. That warrior king who tried to shoot us down. Is he part of the Order? Or, or something new? Hmm, this freestanding column reminds me of the one they just erected in Mexico City. <laughs> erected. Kinda beautiful here. Aside from the agonizing screams of tortured souls. Was this where the worshippers queued up? God's waiting room, so to speak. There is a statue for everything here. Even animal cruelty. I'm, 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 I'm starting to wonder if the sculptors here got paid by the square foot. Ah, just like the markets back home in Mexico. Surely there must be a churro stand here somewhere. A crafting table. Now I know where to take any mystery bits of ancient contraptions. I burned down a market like this back in Paris. It still weighs on my conscience. It said these baths had magical powers. Not smelling like a goat was probably magical enough. Oh, I can't look at a public pool without wondering how much urine is in it. I won't settle the dispute in a Paris bathhouse. It takes much longer to drown someone than you think. Treasuries on a holy site. <sighs> money and religion. Same as it ever was. Don't suppose all this money is cursed, do you? Not that I'm superstitious. Apollo's arrows are all over. Just how big is he? Just look at that chaos crystal thing. They are everywhere. Another chaos crystal. A big one. They're all over, like... like frozen explosions. Is... is that the fabled golden calf from the good book? What? I meant Morley's History of Sculpture. It's a very good book. The Spartans worshipped war, cruelty, and death. And the worst thing is, they made it appear glorious, no? I see Athena and Poseidon. But who is the woman who lost her head? That statue is holding a sentinel artifact. Petrified ghouls! Now there's something you don't see every day. <clears throat> she won't let go. It's stuck. Ah, bloody thing won't shift. The headless one. She holds a sentinel artifact. <clears throat> I cannot pry it from her grasp. Awaken, my soldiers! Slay these pawns of the Pythia! Amigos, this does not look good. Shit, I think we're goners. That creature up on the podium, was that their master? Is it Dia de los Muertos already? Aim for the head or they get back up. Those are fucking Spartoi, the skeleton guys from Dad's mythology books. Looks like it takes a headshot to keep the Spartoi down. Skeleton warriors? How does that even work? There's no bloody muscles. Unfair. It was dead, but it got back up. Let's see how it likes a headshot. I'm guessing not too much. Walking skeletons. Truly, we are in hell. These skeletons do not die easy. Try shooting their skulls. A flying horse! If I tame the winged horse, I shall have to get pictures. Holy crap. Is that Pegasus? I was never one of those horse gals, but I could be persuaded. There's too many coming! Too many! That's bloody Pegasus up there! It is divine intervention! The gods have sent us Pegasus! Worry not, Pegasus. I am gentler than I look. Whoever told me I am all hands never saw this guy. I recognize that monster. It's called a Giganese. Let's see how hard it is to kill. Looks like the Blightfather has competition in the ugly department. Well, 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 if it isn't Shiva's ex-husband. at the same time. They had more arms than you. Pegasus bids you all to take flight. Gracias for that rescue at the amphitheater. I owe you one. Orale, caballo! Fly me to victory! Okay, big fella. Let's ride. Wow. Just... Wow. 
Be gentle, Pegasus. I can get a bit saddle sore. <laughs> Bloody Nora, this horse even smells good! I am mounting Le Cheval Volant. Where it flies is another question. Pegasus, mon ami, let us take to the sky. Where are you going, Caballo? This looks like a bad idea. You're, uh, you're headed straight for the falls. Whoa, big fella, slow down! Pegasus, no, not the waterfall. Ha! Ah, clever horse. There's a whole other half to this place? If my mind were a landscape, it would look like this. This must be where Delphi hid its sins. Intruders! Tell the Pythia I will not be stopped. Is Pegasus injured? Where did he go? This is the river that made Achilles invincible, no? <laughs> Little Diego is taking a dip. I hope Pegasus is all right. Welcome to hell. Don't drink the water. Ah, we're stranded. How the deuce do we find our way back? I always knew I would end up in hell. I just didn't think it would happen so soon. Hmm. These snake scales are not as slippery as they look. Running on a giant snake. Is this what my life has become? This place would drive anyone mad as a hatter. Good job I'm already there. I do not know who this giant woman was, but she sure pissed off Apollo. I'd like to say nice view, you know, if it weren't for the goddess of pincushions over there. Oh, I can picture Hephaestus himself banging out knickknacks for the gift shop of the gods. <sighs> Is that a forge or a crematorium? Either would seem appropriate. Not even the heat down here can banish the chill in my soul. Is that a workbench by the forge? This area could prove useful. This area looks like it might collapse any minute. You are free, Senor Aguila! Do not forget who your friends are! You're Zeus's eagle. That means you're on my side, right? Hello, Eagle of Zeus! I am Stanton Shore of London, and I do not taste good! Repay this kindness, eagle! I need all the help I can get! Las Aguilas, they are attacking that crystal! The eagles uncover the sacred Omphalos, the navel of the world. Ah, the forge that turns guns into cannons! Get out of there, bird! They're destroying that chaos crystal! The eagles uncover the sacred Omphalos, the navel of the world. And there it is, the magic oven of ultimate firepower. Pow! Poof! Bang! What's under that crystal? Eagle Chow? The eagles uncover the sacred Omphalos, the navel of the world. What are those eagles doing? The eagles uncover the sacred Omphalos, the navel of the world. This machine, it seems integral to every step of our journey. But where is it leading us? What's on the other side of this machine? What is it we see? So, this is the fabled navel of the world, is it? Yeah, <laughs> more like it's hemorrhoid. Oh, thank goodness, manky ghouls are starting to build up a tolerance to bullets. <laughs>